Hi friends, I am Dr. Amit Karkare and I am again here with a new episode of Batch Flower Remedies with Dr. Amit. And today we are going to see mustard. Now the negative quality of mustard, uh, before I discuss with about the negative qualities of mustard, I would like to read uh, what Dr. Batch says about uh, about mustard in his uh, in his book 12 Healers. 12 Healers is the uh, is the basic source book that each and every person should read. Uh, there have been comments uh, on the videos asking me about what source book should we read. I think just a day before somebody had asked me asked me this. I think everybody should uh, visit uh, the website of Batch Center, and they have few books in PDF form, and you should read uh, the basic books uh, that Dr. Batch has written first. So the twelve healers. Uh, the lecture that he has given, uh, Heal Thyself, uh, is another book where he discusses about the philosophy of uh, how we fall ill, how we should uh, approach an illness or a patient. Uh, so 12 Healers is the book where, 12 Healers and Other Remedies is the book where he has discussed in, in short about each and every remedy and that's what uh, is, the, is the basic source book that uh, we all should refer. Whatever the rest, is all uh, the interpretations and experiences and the additions by the rest of the people. So whatever I am talking uh, will also be my additions uh, based on my experiences. But before going or before understanding it from me, it's always better that everybody should go and first read what Dr. Batch wants to say. So we'll read that. Uh, so Dr. Batch says in mustard, it is for those who are liable to times of gloom or even despair as though a dark, cold cloud overshadowed them and hid the light and the joy of life. It may not be possible to give any reason or explanation for such attacks. Under these conditions, it is almost impossible to appear happy and cheerful. So this is, these are the words by Dr. Batch uh, about mustard. We have discussed Aspen. Aspen had a fear, a, a feeling of apprehension, foreboding. Uh, where there was, there was no cause, there was no cause of feeling fearful, but still they were suddenly feeling fearful. There was no specific cause of fear. There was, they could not, uh, they could not point out to a specific subject of fear or object of fear that I have fear of uh, dogs. Now that is mimulus. When they have nothing to fear, but still they feel fearful, apprehensive, anxious. That was Aspen. In the similar manner, when you suddenly feel depressed, you suddenly feel loss of interest in uh, the daily activities. You suddenly feel gloomy and sad where there is nothing happening bad in your life. Everything is going good. The stock market is booming. Uh, you have a good family. They have a very, you have a very good relation with your family members. Uh, your professional life is going good. Uh, there has been a pleasant weather outside. There is a sunny weather, but still you are feeling bad. So though there is a sunny uh, weather outside, when you feel like as if there is a dark, gloomy, cold uh, cloud which has overshadowed you. Uh, and there is no reason, uh, that's, that's the feeling of mustard. So mustard has a negative feeling of sudden gloom which comes out of no reason. And at times it can remain for a day or two or, or, or for even for a week or maybe a couple of days. And it just goes suddenly without any uh, without any reason. So it comes suddenly without any reason. It goes suddenly without any reason. So something happens and some uh, all of a sudden the person feels cheerful. Now that's that's typically mustard. The clinical or practical applications of mustard typically uh, it's been one of the best remedies that I have used for premenstrual anxiety or premenstrual depression. Typically uh, in premenstrual syndrome, ladies they suffer with. Uh, sudden uh, few days of sadness they start they feel like crying when there is nothing happening nothing bad happening in their life so this just 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 they can just perceive everything in in, in a bad sense and this just just go on crying uh, they have depressive moments they have low mood they don't feel like doing anything they just feel like they they feel everything is bad and the husband is uh, in confusion he says ki boss Kya hua aapko? There is nothing, I didn't say anything, nobody is saying anything. In fact, I am taking all good care of you, but still she feels, I know, I know, I know you are taking good care of me, but still I am feeling so low and I am feeling so so sad. 
that's a typical uh, negative st- uh, phase of mustard and that's a typical or very commonly uh, common situation where we can use mustard uh, there was a query uh, by one somebody when he uh, asked me that why can't i discuss cases i have uh, i usually try to keep my videos short maybe not more than 5 or 7 minutes uh, we will be discussing cases but once we finish up with all the remedies we will be discussing about comparison of remedies we'll be discussing about various cases various different ways of applying those remedies uh, so this this uh, channel will not end uh, by covering just 38 remedies uh, we will be covering newer and newer aspects of bash for remedies so as and when i will get uh, some new thought i will be uh, sharing with you but that's mustard so the negative quality of mustard is uh, sudden gloom and the positive quality is cheerfulness so if you give mustard the person becomes cheerful uh, whenever there is a pattern of premenstrual syndrome and the person the, the lady going into uh, such kind of sad and gloomy and crying spells uh, you can also give mustard as uh, as a preventive remedy not i won't say that as a actually preventive remedy but uh, when you know that's a pattern which has been uh, set and every time uh, the just a few days before the menses whenever there is a pattern of uh, the lady going into depression you can you can give a, a, a bottle of mustard and you can ask her to take just four or five days before uh, the expected date of the menstrual cycle and possibly then we can reduce uh, the, uh, the the premenstrual phase possibly the effect or the intensity of the premenstrual phase so that is uh, one way by, by which you, you all can uh, use mustard so this is typically how uh, the mustard manifests and how we can use mustard <clears throat> if you want to know more about uh, such remedies please subscribe to our channel uh, this channel will obviously discuss about various aspects of health homeopathy and bachelor remedies uh, you can definitely write uh, your questions in the comment section but uh, to be very frank i don't have a team uh, with me so obviously i i need to check uh, the comment sections uh, regularly which does not happen at times because of my practice uh, so if you want a quicker answer then just drop an email to me uh, the email address has been given in the description below uh, so just drop an email to me and i am definitely i will uh, re- reply faster uh, to the email thanks again for watching this video please do share please do subscribe And please, please do give me your uh, feedbacks and inputs. Thank you.